Hey gang, what's up? Just a quick little walk around of something I've been playing with for the last couple weeks. I'm working to deal with this kid to buy this old 79 Firebird. It's a little Esprit. Uh, it's pretty clean. He brought it back from California six years ago, he says. Bottoms of the fenders are good. Down the side's good. Get to the dog legs on both sides, they got a rot hole in them. Kind of like that there. Not too bad, super easy patchwork. Put brand new tires on two weeks ago, right before I bought it. Um, timing chain went out of it. He said it just doesn't run. He didn't know why. I hopped in, hit the key, and it just backfires through the car. So I'm sure it's a timing chain, it's out. Not that really matters. I got a nice little uh, 355 small block I'm going to throw into the thing. Super clean underneath. No light here, but you can see the rear body panel's good. Super nice. I don't rot it out like the shit up here in Minnesota. But down the bolts are all good. The exhaust is all rotted off on the thing. It comes out of the converter only. But uh, nice shape. Nice car. 600 bucks. Pretty happy with that. It'd be a good little, little ride for Mama Bear. I got some Trans Am wheels, some 8 inch snowflakes I'll stick on it. I'll get rid of these red tail lights and put the black opaque Trans Am style in. I got a set of those. It's got rear to frost. Typical busted GM handle. They always do that. Let's see if I can get this thing open. There we go. We can totally tell it's a southern car or a western car. Crack dash. Just cooked interior. All dried and flaky. You know, all this crap just comes right off. Like, mmm. Not too bad, it's got good floors, even got some money back. Look at that there, and the guy forgot his change. Here's the ashtray. Alright, that's cool. Weird options. Deluxe. Rear view mirror, if you guys can see that. Power windows. Aftermarket stereo, which I don't really care, whatever. Rear to frost, air. Console, it's an option. Broken armrest, standard. No power locks. Power locks supposed to be right here. No power locks. Weird. What's in here? Oh, that's the, uh, oh yeah, power trunk too. Let's see what that does, if that works. Nice. This is warranty for his tires. This kid just paid 360, 360 bucks for these tires on this car. What a dumbass. But uh, she's a re-squirter at one time or another, looking at the jams. Obviously, we got blue and dark blue here. This must be the original color here. Kind of like a Atlantis blue. This might buff out nice, but I might just repaint it. If I'm doing these dog legs, there's nowhere to stop. You know, you start here, you fix it all. Go into this rocker, come back up. You know, there's nowhere to stop. So you just paint the whole damn car. Might as well. It's clean enough. Quarters are all nice and steely. That's what the trunk looks like. I don't think I've ever looked in the trunk. Factory air pump, western car for sure at that point. They don't have that shit around here. Trunk's nice and solid. Got the original splatter. Some ghetto speakers. What's this here? That's where the jack goes. Just a floor mat. Got factory deck. No, there's some junky old one. Some drain pan. Huh. No posi decal. That kind of sucks, but whatever. We expect with a standard issue. Rear of frost. Nice. Did just a horrible job on taping this car. I mean, look at these tape off lines. They're just brutal. But that works. That's cool. I know it spins over, but it won't fire. These fenders are good. Nice and tinny, no thuds. Look how clean that frame is. I don't know if you guys can see that. You would not find a car up here that clean. But, this is from another piece of shit I was hauling the other day. Uh, let's see here. That's all good. Busted grill. I got a couple sets of those. Squish bumper nose. I got a whole bumper assembly off another 79 Trans Am somewhere. I just gotta find it. You know how that goes. Let me set you guys down here and pop open the hood.
just in time to get you in the fall. Here's what you got. <coughs> 305, two barrel, EGR, air pump gone, AC's all there, belt still on it, good sign. Thing is a mucho grande leaker. I mean, look at that mess. You know, I was just gonna put a timing chain in this thing and get it running. But I think I'm just gonna do that engine transplant and be done with it. No underhood mat. Five liter. Good battery. Yeah, man, pretty cool. Let's step back and get a whole view at her. She's not too shabby. Kind of like the Rockford Files look. No spoilers, no this, no that. Just a car with some good stuff. I got a Posi 10 bolt with a 373 ringing gear. Ringing pinion in that one. I can throw that in there if I really wanted to, I guess. Tabs are due. Yeah, dude, she's pretty sweet. It shines up okay, it looks like. Here's my uh, 98 Z71 just picked up. Dude, look at that thing. She's a squatter. Holy Christ. That's embarrassing. Got to steer with the brakes because it's just to the rug. But I picked this thing up total here at my buddy's salvage yard. Total lost brokers in Chaska. But... Uh, there you have it guys. I'm gonna go put it away. I'm supposed to get some snow tomorrow, so we'll see how that pans out. So I get this hood down without fucking it up. Nice. But yeah, pretty cool man. It'll be a little project car. I think I'll get the engine up and running and maybe mess around with those rockers this, this winter. Since the shed's heated now. But this truck man, check it out. I'm gonna stick a new box on it. Just find a used box in color. I got another door in color, get rid of that rusty one. It's a Wisconsin truck. This hood's been replaced already. It's got some dings on it, some hail I got for free. It's got some damage on the roof. It's okay. It's all good in the front. Replaced this fender and that door already. You can kind of see the color difference a little bit between the post and the door, but not very. I'm, I'm gonna live with it. I'm gonna fix this cab corner. When I get a different box, I'll just spray that with my color spray out and make sure it all matches. But, uh, oops, slow, your windows lock, still cruise, Vortec 350 automatic. Works, man, 800 bucks, I'm not gonna bitch. Well, there it is. You guys have a good weekend coming up. I'm gonna keep my fingers crossed for my Colts and see if we can get one more win, or at least one win this year, that'd be awesome. One more walk around. All right, man, that's there we go, guys. Peace out.